So I'm about to record a video and this is what this guy bought for me. Does it make sense? Are you encouraging me or discouraging me from my quest? I need to wear a beep so I don't see your quest. What beep? What is wrong with you? So guys, I'm about to start recording my video. Aloha. This is Rosa Khan. I don't care. This is the best trip for me. So guys, I'm done with my corn. That was super yummy. I am just trying to make my hair be presentable. Okay, okay, now I'm ready. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Chika Jim Silas. I am a fashion entrepreneur and a beauty lover. You can call me the plus size fashion, but I make cool videos in fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. Welcome back to my channel. Long time no makeup video, so I thought today, let me do like a no makeup makeup look, which is like really who I am. A lot of times I just do makeup because I love makeup, but I don't wear makeup all the time. So sometimes when I need to rush out, I'll just slap on some makeup real quick. So I wanted to show you guys that look today, my no makeup makeup look. And as usual, it's like a get ready with me kind of video. You know, I struggle to concentrate on makeup and talking, but we will find a way to kind of make you work. So let's go straight into it. My face is stripped, is washed. I don't have anything on my face. So the first thing I'm going to be doing is I'm going to try and moisturize, not try, actually moisturize my face using my Clarins daytime cream. What's it called? Extra Femin Ju. I believe Ju means day, right? Correct me if I'm wrong. It's wrinkle control feminine drying day cream. So I'm just going to be slapping that all over my face, rubbing it right into my skin. Mm. All the way to my neck. So what have you guys been up to this whole quarantine season? I'm happy places are opening me up, but I still have a problem going out because first of all, I hate to wear that dreadful mask. But I know we need to wear it so that we can keep safe and blah -de blah -de blah blah. So yeah, so now that I've put my moisturizer on my face, mm, let's have corn around. Sorry. Anyway, so because I'm going for like a no makeup makeup tap a look, I am going to be using my NARS Namibian Shea Glow. That's my shade. So I'm just going to put a bit of that on my hand to warm it up a bit. And it goes into my skin so as you can see it's like skin finish it literally is skin finish makeup or foundation so I'm just slapping that on real quick this is like literally a five minutes makeup look that I'm going for clearly we can't do it in five minutes on video but in real life I think I can try if I like really had to run I can actually get this in five minutes. So I'm just slapping this on. Sorry if I'm looking that way. I'm not cross-eyed. I just, I'm looking at the mirror. And the mirror is not in focus. The mirror is that way, so. So actually, I'm not really going anywhere today. I want to try on um, clothes for my store. If you do not know, I do have a plus-size fashion store. I sell the best clothes in Lagos for plus-size women. Argue with your keypad. Seriously. It is what it is. So I'm going to be trying on some clothes for my store for advertising purposes. So I just start to look a bit cute for the videos instead of going like barefaced. So now that I'm done with this, I am just going to make my face a bit dry by slapping on some powder. So before the powder, let me quickly highlight my under eyes and I'm going to be using my Fenty Matchstick in Swiss. So this just goes right under my eyes. Here I put some in my nose here to brighten up the look that I am going for. So yeah, same thing, just dab, 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 dab in. By the way, I am using my beauty blender from a brand in Nigeria called New Band Beauty. So one of the things that, I, that has kind of kept me going during this quarantine is actually work. I realized that without work, I am basically empty. I don't know if that is a good thing, but like that's what I've done during this whole time. I've just tried to just focus on working. And thankfully, 
people are actually shopping during the quarantine so it keeps me busy so that's what i'm going to just focus on doing it gives me life walking gives me life i don't know if it's because i really enjoy what i do which is like catering to my plus size community like kind of getting them clothes like i mean you know how it is the story is the same globally plus size women have a hard time finding like clothes that are their size or even flattering clothes because normally when you eventually find the clothes they're like clothes that you're just like am i really going to wear this anyways i really enjoy doing this but it has become increasingly difficult because most places are closed dollar is skyrocketing everything is going crazy but still i'm just thankful that we are able to stay afloat i mean that's the reason why i set up the business in the first place. i should actually do a video on my whys and hows how i set up my plus size store if you know what i mean i think that should be the next video i mean it's kind of like a serious business like a video but i'll try and make it as fun as possible so you guys have an insight in case you want to start your store it doesn't have to be plus size maybe any fashion store so i can give you like clues on how to go about it yeah it's, a, it's about time i'm more serious in, on my channel so yeah i think that would be a really super cool video to do this is benign banana powder i'm just trying to set the concealer that i put real quick and this helps i like to put it in my brow bone area as well because it makes that area dry for me to just pop in my eye pencil quickly i'm going to line my brows i will be using the bm pro high pencil in dark brown guys my pencil is a disgrace who uses their pencil up to this point like i don't think i've ever used any eye pencil that goes to show that i really like it and it's not even imported it's something i can easily go and get another one i should actually so i'm just going to fill in my brows nice and easy i'm sure you've watched me do this a thousand times or you watch other people but this is how i do mine just two cool strokes one from the bottom right underneath my brows and the other one on the top and light strokes in between to fill it in there you go nothing fancy just simple straight to the point brows remember we're going for like a really easy look i'm just going to repeat the same process here real quick yes yeah so as i was saying like running a business in nigeria is very different to from running businesses everywhere else in the world government policies shipping policies everything is always a problem the naira the currency value always depreciates and like in this pandemic the naira has gone to shit so dollar rates are driving us crazy it's like all sorts of crazy things like so basically businesses here are really struggling to stay afloat so shout out to my fellow business owners it hasn't been easy but we are doing our best to make it worth it and for someone like me i feel like i owe, i have a duty hey to satisfy my people i mean the joy it brings when i see that people looking like super cute wearing out free for my stores like oh my god that like really makes me happy and excited and it just kind of validates the reason behind what i do because that was the reason in the first place i decided to set up my store because i wanted to make women happy regardless of size size beauty comes in every size so i wanted to make people happy that's one of my whys i'm already giving you the expo of what i'm going to tell you in my next video so now that i'm done with that i don't want my face like super cake so i'm just going to wipe up my excess powder before i fine-tune my brow using concealer okay i have succeeded in not bringing out the concealer to line my brows so what i'm gonna do is i am going to use my fancy stick in suede which i use for underneath my eyes that's not what i'll use normally but i'm going to use it right now and my phone is ringing i'm sorry hello Rossi. i'm good what's up yeah 
uh, no problem call james when you get here i'm filming a video so he's interrupting my video all right then. okay bye sorry guys i had to pick up a phone i know i like need to go to school of youtube ethics but that was my cousin calling me that her kids are on their way here by the way so yeah i'm just going to fine tune my brows nice and easy oh i wish i had a concealer but yeah we're going for it no makeup makeup look so we really don't even need anything dramatic so this is what it is nice and easy chicks easy does it baby guys it's so difficult to do your makeup and be chit chatting i mean i'm getting better at it but man it used to be so tough for me but i think i'm getting better so i'm thankful to be able to still walk at times like this i know that some people are having difficulties because their businesses have been shut down for so long i'm hoping and praying that everything opens up completely very soon hopefully at the end of the month so please hang in there if you're one of them i know that's such tough times especially for entrepreneurs and then for some people they still have to pay their staff even if it's just giving them like a token they still have to do that so it's like shout out to bosses who are really considerate what better palette to use than my zara nude eyeshadow palette as you can see it has like really earthy tones because i am going for like a super nude no makeup makeup look so the first color i'm going to be using is this one in mocha mocha is like a dark brown shade and i'm just going to pop that into my crease slash the outer corners of my eyes because it's like such is the perfect brownish shade and i absolutely love it so, so that's to make mocha a bit um give it a bit more depth i'm going to be using the color dune so dune has a bit more color dune is my go-to blush so basically this palette can save your life if you want to do like a no makeup makeup look this is like your go-to palette it has such earthy tones and the fun part about this is that you can actually use the eyeshadow as blush and contour as well so this is my best travel palette because everything in there works and serves a purpose like it has all the things that you need this palette it's called the zaron earth palette you should get it and you can actually get it from the link in my bio on instagram if you follow me on instagram i actually have a personalized zaron shop where you can shop from so i'm just putting this other color called bear to give it a bit of depth so that's pretty much what i'm doing on my eyes apart from one more color so just to brighten up my eyelids a bit i'm going to be going in with i'm just trying to wet my eyeshadow brush so i'm going to be going up going in with this color on my eyelid so my eyelid is not bare it's called sahara it's called sahara sorry i used the green eyeshadow and it literally turned this brush into green for good so i'm just putting sahara on my eyelid so it doesn't look bare So that is it. That is all that I am using for my eyes. Simple. And then if I want to open up my eyes a bit, I can use the gold color right in the middle of the palette. It's called Coral. So I'm just going to use Coral in the inner corners of my eyes. Just a little bit. It's no makeup, makeup cheeks. No makeup, makeup. Because before you know it, Madame will go overboard with everything typical. So yeah, just blending that in a little bit here and there, just so everything turns into one big happy family. I do hope I'm not covering my face all through the look. So yeah. So yeah, that's it for my eyes. I'm done. So now I'm just going to put a blush and the blush I'm using is Dune from my palette. It's the S palette, Zaron S palette. I'm going to be using the color Dune as my blush perfect for a brown skin girl so yeah so basically some good things have come out of this quarantine like i said i've been able to focus more on my business i've spent time with my kids i really really 
enjoy doing that even though that comes with the stress of like the whole homeschooling thing but thankfully my husband is so supportive and he's hands-on with that because that can also drive people crazy like oh dear teachers how do you cope so now i'm going to be using the color frost as the color frost same palette that's it frost is up there somewhere can you see yeah so that's frost it's like the first color on the palette i'm just going to be using frost frost to highlight a little bit i'm still going to use a proper highlighter but i kind of like to use frost as a base because it's just sort of brightens the area up already i don't know if you can see so yeah that's a good old kajal so i'm going to be using my fenty matte stick and okay i found it i'm going to be using it in espresso oh my god i still have some corn in my mouth i hope you can see <laughs> hey So I'm going to be, I use my matte stick in express. So it is not a lipstick. It is something for your face. It's actually to contour. But yours truly likes to do the most. So I use it for my lips. This is the best nude lipstick in the whole world. I tell you for free. And it is Malika and Chloe. Yes, Malika and Chloe Best Friends by Becca. It is so yummy. I don't know if they still sell it. If they still sell it, I will go and I'll buy five. Like, I never want to run out. It is awesome. Mm. Can you see that? It just disappears into it. It marries the Fenty Beauty nicely. The Fenty Matchstick in Espresso. So this is my favorite nude go-to. No makeup, makeup lipstick. Like... It is my best test nude lipstick ever and we're almost done we're almost done i just need to do a little bit of contouring i know i said five minutes but you know how it is it's just because i'm talking but literally if i had to do this i could do it in five minutes seriously so yeah i wanted to use a powder contour kit because it's quicker as opposed to using i could use my espresso as well but on this occasion, I want to use my powder contour. So I'm just going to pop that right here. As you can see, it sucks in my cheeks nice and easy. So I'm going to do the same thing over here. And I'm also going to use it under my chin. As a big girl, this is very necessary because you know you want to be taking out some excess bits. So yes, yeah, so this goes here. And a little bit on my forehead so i'm going to be using so aesthetic liquid eyeliner i'm surprised it's still there because i've been using it for ages i actually need to get some more makeup it's been a while no makeup shopping i kind of had to discipline myself because i keep buying makeup that i never use so i'm actually quite proud of myself that i have empties that should also be another video that i do because it's very difficult for me to have empties because i'm always buying makeup that i don't wear so yeah so if i actually have empties know that that item is really really good and i must really like it for you to have finished so i should actually do empties my 2020 empties video i'm feeling inspired today i'm already thinking of videos ahead of time oh i'm getting there man with this youtube game shit man chicala so nothing dramatic just my eyeliner done check so i'm going to spray my face a little bit before i do my final highlighting and that's it that is it so this is what is this omanis rose water hydrating mist so i'm just going to hydrate my face a bit so that is prepped for my highlighter Cause I want like the glowy skin type of type of effect. No dryness, no cakiness. <coughs> I think I put that in my mouth. <laughs> so now I'm just going to apply my highlighter and powder all over my face, and I'm done. Ha! Brown skin girl, can you see? Can you see the effect? Like the no makeup makeup vibes. Okay, let me use my glow kit. I know I said no makeup makeup, but this glow kit is another problem. Cause a little goes a long way. 
so i'm going to be using the color in bronzed i know you cannot see it because it's like kind of smashed so it's all over the place so here's what it looks like anyway it's the anastasia glow kit and i'm going to be using bronze i, I tell you I hardly hear people talk about anastasia Beverly Hills nowadays she's still existing because people were crazy about her once upon a time but now i hardly hear people talk about her i hope she's okay so just a teeny weeny bit be cool shine baby <laughs> so yeah that's it pretty much i'm going to look on my nose here cupid bow i'm sorry forgive me if i never look at the viewfinder i'm sorry and that is it that is all i'm just gonna find a powder and i'm just going to pat down everything and we're good to go oh okay should i just pop some lashes okay yeah 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 let me put some lashes but overall you get the drift this is what i'm going for like i just want to look like natural and not so dramatic not too many colors so i'm just turning down the i'm basically just trying to put everything together in one look to make it one cohesive look one is a cohesive or cohesive i think it's cohesive oh english speaking girl chicala if you want to tone down your um um highlighter always put the powder above the highlighter so that really helps yeah without losing the shine it's good i can use my brow brush again because of all the powdering sometimes you lose the smoothness of your brow so i'm just going to use my brow brush again i'm going to just brush my brows in place again so that it's not that wonky okay so guys the, here's the look i'm just going to pop in some lashes and we move i'm a happy bunny it is what it is are you guys watching big brother <laughs> I should do a big brother review guys the time is tough it's very very tough and this crop of people that big brother just chose <laughs> i don't know where he got them from but they're rather fresh so yeah i'm just going to pop in my lashes and we're good to go so guys here's the finished look i just popped in my zara lashes in flutter and i popped in my hoops my hula hoops okay my hoops that's what they're called right anyway my round big earrings and that's it so as you can see this look was achieved with just like browns and subtle golds and earthy tones that's kind of like my everyday go-to makeup and i use my zaron earth palette which is like my holy grail right now you can use it as highlighter contour eyeshadow everything all the works you can use it so that's what i use majorly and i use my nars foundation and then what else yeah I think that's it and i popped in my lashes and voila you're good to you are good to go apart from this video and us chit chatting and me taking my time you can actually do this in five minutes really without the lashes well i don't know about you but for me wearing lashes can take like some three to five minutes because my hands always shake and story for another day but anyways you can do this in five minutes it's real quick it's easy and it's simple i hope you enjoyed watching this video as i enjoyed making the video next week we're going to go more serious i'm going to juice you guys about how and why i decided to start my plus size fashion business in nigeria doing business in nigeria <laughs> Oh my god living in nigeria first of all is the story for another day like it's really hectic and stressful and all oh, but we're survivors and we're doing it and i want to share my story with you which is kind of like the purpose of this channel so if you haven't subscribed hmm, i am watching girl. please subscribe now 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 share comment every little gesture is welcome press the notification bell if you haven't that will also be highly appreciated thank you for watching today's video and i really 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 hope that you enjoyed it. if you want me to do better i'll do something else please leave a message in the comment section and i will be sure to treat it accordingly thank you very very much for watching take care is lots of love and kisses from your plus size fashion boss chica silas thank you for watching